thing was Obama when I was in year 11. Probably the most significant thing was GCSEs. I was about to start my big final major project. After schools shut their gates from Friday afternoon, they will remain closed for most yeah, people, so the vast majority of pupils. Borderline excitement from most of my peers, just everyone yelling out, I can't believe, we, you know, this is happening. We weren't sure about whether it was our last day or not. People taking the piss out of COVID and all that. I couldn't, like, sign my T-shirts as well, so... It was pretty anticlimactic. I had a cold and everyone thought it was COVID, so I wasn't allowed in. And it, it really sucked because all my friends were, like, saying goodbye. I was just going for walks around the local area, taking photos of anything. Spending my 16th birthday in lockdown was a bit shit. I had more time to spend with my family, which was a good thing. I don't know, talk with my family or watching TV or something and not listening to the news or doing anything, you know, COVID-related. I only ever really went around in the village to help help my granddad, um, who has dementia. It was one of the fondest memories I had with him. I had a lot of ambitions, uh, and then that slowly sort of deteriorated. It's like willpower ran out. Watching some movies, going to sleep, doing the same thing the next day. It just came a bit endless. Took a toll, and it was like, ah, oh, I cannot do this anymore. I think I was quite lucky because I was in quarantine with my family and I had I had quite a strong like relationship with them. There was this actor, a comedian called Vivek and he died, he passed away due to Covid. That was like a big shock to every Tamil people. Even now when I think about it, I'm, I'm like, I can't believe he's gone. We lived in such fear and now we're just here and it's like, like no masks, no hand washing, like such close proximity between each other. I look back on it now and I'm like, how strange it was to have to like wipe everything down. It was a bit weird that my mum would disinfect every single item. She must have gone through so much spray and antibacterial wipes. If the lockdown hadn't happened, I would never have found my love for film. It made us realise maybe time, how time is really important. I don't take things for, gra for granted as much anymore.